Hi, this is Joel Mayer. Here is a butterfly project that uses cone style coffee filters. Take a wooden clothespin and paint it in a color of your choice. If necessary, use several coats of paint to hide the wood of the clothespin. While the clothespin dries, take a cone shaped coffee filter. Cut both sides of the cone, leaving the underside attached. Open the filter to form the wings of the butterfly. You could paint the wings as I did in my video about the butterfly made with basket type filters. In this case I will show you how to color the wings using washable markers. It is not necessary to cover the whole surface. Draw straight lines, wavy lines, zigzags or circles, in short, draw whatever you want. If you want to stay closer to nature, represent the wings so that one is the mirror image of the other. When you are satisfied, take a large brush and dab the filter with water. The colors will spread and mix to give interesting effects. Let the wings dry. Cut a piece of magnetic tape to the same width and length as the clothespin. If the tape is not self-adhesive, glue it on the clothespin with hot glue. Then, glue two googly eyes on top of the clothespin near the opening. If you wish, you can also decorate the body using glitter glue. Take a piece of pipe cleaner of your choice to represent the antennas of the butterfly. Glue the antennas behind the eyes. Finally, open the clothespin. Put hot glue inside and put the wings in place so that they are centered with respect to the body. And now your butterfly is ready. Because of the magnet, you can use it to decorate the fridge, for example. Instead of a clothespin, you could use popsicle sticks. For one butterfly, paint two popsicle sticks in the color of your choice. When you are satisfied with the color, glue a magnetic strip on one of the sticks. Take the other stick and glue the eyes on it. This time, I used beads for eyes instead of googly eyes. As with clothespin, I decided to decorate the back of the butterfly with glitter glue. Then, take a piece of pipe cleaner to represent the antennas and glue the antennas in place behind the eyes. Because popsicle sticks are longer than clothespins, you can give your butterfly four wings. That means that you will need two coffee filters. You can again use the technique with felt-tip pens and water, or you can paint the wings. When dry, glue the filters on the side opposite to the magnet. Then, put glue on top of the wings and glue the other popsicle stick with the eyes. The wings should be placed closer to the eyes. As you can see, the magnet holds the butterfly very well on a metal surface. To print the document with illustrated instructions, click on the link below the video and come visit us on the Anima Plates website to find plenty of other ideas.